channel. In this video, I will teach you how to create an animated puzzle diagram in PowerPoint. Let's get started. First, go to the Shapes menu and select a circle. Draw a circle with a size of 11 cm in height and 11 cm in width. Next, make a copy of this circle by holding down the control button and dragging the circle to the side. Adjust the size of the second circle to 4 cm in width and height. Change its color so we can easily differentiate it. Align the smaller circle to the center and middle of the larger circle using the format shape options. Now, select both circles, go to the shape format menu and choose fragment. This will divide the larger circle into multiple parts. You will notice that the center of the larger circle is now empty. To divide the circle into four parts, select a rectangle from the Shapes menu. Draw it so that it passes through the center of the circle. Adjust the width of the rectangle to 0.01 cm and remove its outline. Make a copy of the rectangle, rotate it by 90 degrees and change its color to make it visible. Select the circle and both rectangles. Align them to the center and middle, then go to Shape Format and select Fragment again. This will divide the entire circle into many parts. Delete the extra parts and change the color of each segment of the circle to easily differentiate them. To create a puzzle piece, Take another circle and adjust its size to 1 cm in height and width. Place these small circles on each segment of the divided circle. To create one shape, select a segment of the larger circle and the small circle then go to Shape Format and click Union. Repeat this process for each segment. You will notice that one end of the puzzle piece has a circle, but the other end is filled. To create an empty space at the filled end, take a copy of one puzzle piece and set it aside. Select the remaining two pieces, go to Shape Format and click Fragment. Delete the extra parts and now you have the desired structure. Repeat this process for the other pieces as well. For the central part of the puzzle diagram, take another circle and make its size 0.9 cm. Place it at the four sides of the center. Select all the circles and go to Shape Format to click Union, making them one piece. Make a copy of this central part and set it aside. To make the diagram more professional, subtract the main part of the puzzle from the four segments. Select the four segments and the main part of the diagram, go to Shape Format and select Fragment. Delete the extra parts of the puzzle and then recolor each segment. Now you can see how beautiful it looks. Place the central puzzle piece back in the center of the diagram. Add text to each section according to your needs. For animations, add a fade animation to each puzzle piece and a wipe animation to the text. Repeat this process for all segments. The fade animation will start on click and the wipe animation will start after the previous one. That's it. You've successfully created an animated puzzle diagram in PowerPoint. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more PowerPoint tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.